editing the diagram. Let's go back to a simple flowchart. Select a shape and start typing. Enter starts a new line. Click out of the shape to finish editing. Double clicking on a shape also starts editing. Double clicking anywhere on a connector adds a label there. Double clicking anywhere in space also adds a text only shape. That's a rectangle with no border painted, ultimately. Let's take a quick look at the formatting options available on shapes and edges. There's too much to remember. But for shapes, you see colors, theming options, effects, and shadows. For text, it's the usual font properties, alignment. The Arrange panel relates to the shape geometry. It's generally more advanced stuff. The only thing I will mention is to front and to back. This is found in a lot of drawing tools. It's the Z order of objects as you look into the screen. For connectors, the formatting for text is similar. The main difference is the styling. Here you have the connector styling and the start end arrows. The arrows are probably the thing you'll use the most.